A woman has been arrested in the death of a toddler in Philadelphia. The little girl was found partially buried earlier this week in an Ogons Park. That's where we find our Shantae Lands with more on the investigation. Shantae. Well, Yuki, a makeshift memorial it continues to grow here outside the wooded area where Alina Barnes was found. And tonight, police believe that they have her killer. Two roses represent a little girl who died just shy of reaching two years of life. Just sad that somebody could do that to a child. Philadelphia police say 33-year-old Naisha Corbett suffocated 22-month-old Alina Barnes before burying her in a shallow grave in the woods in North Philadelphia's Kimball Park. It's a terrible tragedy uh, for a child to meet an end such as this, no, and this shouldn't happen to no one. Police believe Corbett killed the toddler last Tuesday, October 9th. They say she told her mother the following week on Monday that Alina was missing. Her mother told police and a search ensued. Corbett led detectives to the toddler's shallow grave. She lived in an apartment across the street. Philadelphia police say surveillance cameras like this one captured Naisha Corbett walking across the street into Kimball Park with a baby carrier in her hand. Detectives believe the girl was already deceased. It's disgusting, you know what I mean? Because kids, they don't have that choice of who they live with. Investigators say Corbett was caring for Alina for the past several weeks. She has two young children of her own with Alina's father. Alina's mother is currently in a Montgomery County jail on theft charges. Oh, yeah, that's just sad. I can't imagine as a mom hearing that in jail that my child is gone. And I spoke with the funeral director. He said he just wanted to come out here and see the site. He says the family is understandably distraught. DHS has since stepped in and they're now investigating. That's the very latest live at Kimball Park in North Philadelphia. Shantae Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Alex. Shantae, thank you.